Okay, I've been putting these caps on. You can see we're getting pretty far into this thing. I should have this done today. Uh, putting the top and bottom caps on. Uh, basically what you're doing here is you're drilling those two holes and then you're drilling the end hole which is for the back to mount the control board. And what I'm doing is I'm using that hole to line these up and then I'm drilling these holes. That way the, this can't be out of alignment and it, it's working pretty well so I'm just drilling these holes I already drilled these four so basically I'm drilling those holes and then I'm mounting them then removing those And then flip it over and drill the other side. You can see here, this is uh, most of these are working pretty good. A few of them, the wire seems to be a little bit longer. I wound this wire a year ago. So, uh, I really wasn't sure if it was all 65 feet. Might have been a little longer. But, because of the way the, the nature of the sequential firing of the coils, uh, it can be a little bit longer. It doesn't matter. Some of them worked perfectly. They went together without an issue. That's, that one's exactly 65 feet. I know because both those are cut and they've never been cleaned. So I know that one was uh, when I did that one. So that's what you're shooting for. And uh, this one, as you can see, looks a little longer. But it does fit on there. So <laughs> uh, when you make yours, you won't have those issues. The 65 feet ones went together perfectly. I hate to cut a little bit of wire off of a something I twisted together. I guess it's my failing that I hate to waste that wire, but sure enough, I'm that way. So I'm using a clamp to squeeze it together and because I was shooting that I wasn't paying attention and didn't clean that out. So, Duh. Can I, say? I, I hate that something to look un, unfinished so we're going to pull that out of there so, just to clean it out So, all right, there's another one down. We'll have 15. I actually have enough wire for 16, as you can see down there, but that one, I, when I tested it, it was, the wire was broke, the trigger wire, so. Out of 16 coils, I had one wire break. So, I have to fix it before I can put that last coil together, which is not that necessary right now. I have enough to do what I wanna do here. 15 gives me six on the small motor, nine on the large motor. Those are additional coils because I don't know how, how it's going to react. You know, the wheel's on three foot something wide, so I've never tried to push something that wide, that large before. thing weighs 100 pounds, so it might take more coils, so I'm ready for it. If it does, I can put additional coils together. So, all right, I'm going to finish putting these together, and then we're going to the control boards.